Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. I'm Lindsay Watson. A former teacher's aide charged following an inter interaction with a special needs student was back in a Trumbull County courtroom today to learn his fate. Uh, reporter Nadine Grimley was there and has the latest tonight. We are here advocating for our son as well as all people in this fragile and, uh, and often overlooked population who cannot defend themselves. Standing before Judge Cynthia Westcott Rice, the mother of a special needs student, described how Stephen Bornemis's actions while he was working as a teacher's aide for a Trumbull County Educational Service Center multiple disabilities classroom have impacted her son. He just sat there and took Mr. Bornemis's anger by being forced to his feet repeatedly, pushed up against a wall, and pulled upstairs. This trauma has deeply affected our happy-go-lucky, extremely loving child for the worst. Bornemis pleaded guilty to a bill of information, charging him with misdemeanor endangering children back in February. He apologized to the victim's family, saying he knows he made some wrong decisions. I was trying to do my job as I was trained to do. I really enjoyed working with these students and helping them through their school day. I never meant to harm anyone. I'm truly sorry for what happened. Pointing to his lack of criminal record and his low risk of reoffending, Judge Rice sentenced Bornemis to three years probation. Bornemis was also ordered to complete an anger management class, plus pay court costs and a monthly probation supervision fee. In Warren, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.